Hello everyone and welcome to a very relaxing Sunday afternoon and we are taking a moment out of our very busy schedule as mayor, digging up fossils, dashing about town to help our villagers, fishing up all sorts of rare fish and sharks in order to give them to Blathers and fill up our museum to take a moment to relax at the Dream Suite. So today we are going to go on our very first Dream Town tour. I've never done this before but I'm very excited and I know the basic premise of the idea is that you step within these doors. And then you fall asleep, you take a nice little meditation sort of dream, and you're able to go visit other people's villages. And for the autumn season, I have actually looked up a few of the autumn towns that I've seen floating around on Tumblr. So we have a special town we're going to be visiting today. So let's go ahead, step on in, and try this out for the very first time. I've never done this before, so I'm not sure how it's really done. Why, hello, Luna, huh? Hmm, welcome. This is the luxurious dream suite where we offer you your relaxation within your stressful life. Oh, are you not the mayor of Moss Tree? We have two, we too have many pleasant conversations in the dream world. Really? I am honored by the chance to converse whilst we're awake. Hmm, now please indulge me as I give you a brief overview of our suite. Whilst relaxing in our suite, you may enjoy the dream towns of those slumbering both near and far. And whilst in a dream, you can walk around town and sightsee just as if you were awake. Ah, you can use the internet to download dream the dreams of towns from all over the world. I'm sure at least one will be to your sleeping mind's liking. In addition, I can help you share a dream of this town, sending it to those dreaming around the globe. Oh, I suppose I should ask you... Uh, yes, yes, yes I can. Yes it is. Wonderful. So she's very pleased. Alright, so we can go ahead and we can dive in. Good. If you want to dream, please lie down over there on the bed. However, if you want to share a dream with this town, please, of the town, please lie down on the couch at the back. Oh, this is so interesting. Oh my gosh, I love how she has a little incense dry right here. That's awesome. I love the way they just pop up in unexpected places. And she has a cocoa bean bush back here. Wow. Okay, well, what we want to do is we're going to go on our dream town tour now. Yes, I would like to have a dream. Oh, it costs bells. Okay, that's fine. All right. And hopefully, I've never done this before, so hopefully I'll be able to do this okay. And then next time we'll just start in the actual dream town. But I would love to go on a dream every Sunday and just be able to sit back and tour your towns and tour some of the towns I can find. Okay, what kind of dream would you like to have? I would like to input a dream address, like themed towns, because some people work so hard on their towns. It's really amazing to see. And I would love to visit some of your dream towns. So if you guys have dream town addresses, then feel free to leave them in the comments. And what I'll do is I'll make a big list. And then maybe once a month, I'll go and visit one of our community member dream towns. And that'll be my goal. To, we'll start it once a month and maybe I can do it more often, but I'll use a random generator to pick from the list that you guys give me. If you want to tell me your town name, if you would like to tell me the name you would like to be referred by and the town address, then once a month, I'll try to visit one of our member, like one of our community member dream towns too at random. I'll use a random generator so it's fair. That sounds so fun. Ah, so you already know the dream address for the town you want to dream about. Can you share it with me, please? All right, so we're going to be visiting a special town and I will actually try to remember to leave a comment down below that will share this with you guys. There we go. And then let's make sure I get this right so I don't like end up in some sort of scary, scary town. All right. Yep. 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 All right. There we go. The dream address leads to the town of Tortal. Do you want to dream about that town? I sure do. All right. So I picked Tortal because it came up on a list of autumn themed dream towns. And Tortal is actually named after, I believe, if it's the, the same series that I enjoyed, the Lioness, Alana the Lioness series. Oh, I'm wearing a cute little outfit from Tamora Pierce's books. And those are some of my favorite books growing up. And if you guys have read The Lioness Quartet, then please let me know. If you've read any of uh, Pierce's other books as well, I've read pretty much all of them and I loved them growing up. Wild Magic was probably my favorite. One sheep, two sheep, three. 
All right, so let's see what Tort Hall is like. I'm so excited. We're going to see a town that's been properly taken care of by somebody who actually knows what they're doing in New Leaf for the first time. Who knows what kind of public work projects we might see? Who knows what kind of villagers we might see? I, I'm so excited. I've never met any of the villagers beyond the campers and the people that we've run into before. Oh my goodness, the whole place is like paved. Welcome to the world of dreams. Right now you are having a dream of a sleepy town called Tortal. When you want to return to the real world, the world of stress, please lie down on this bed once more. Hmm, I hope you have the most amazing time here in the dreamy world of Tortal. Oh my gosh, we're here! It's the very first time I've ever been on a dream! Oh my goodness, and the town is so different. Wow, I, I, I know that sounds silly, but it just threw me that actually the town is built completely different than my town. Oh my goodness. Oh, what is this? That is so cool. And there's little fish puffs coming out of there. Oh, and these are, these are, these are golden. You guys, these are golden roses. I can't believe this. And these are lilies. Look at these lily of the valleys. This is so pretty. This is so lovely. Look at all of these. Oh, wow. Oh, and there's a little fish. Oh, that's so cool. Wow, look at these paths. And there's little shrubs everywhere. I don't have any little shrubs. <gasps> look at this thing. What is this thing? Is it a geyser? If I stare at it long enough, will I actually like spit out some water? Oh, that's so interesting. Oh, that little shrub didn't make it right there. Oh my goodness, there's a lighthouse. <gasps> that is so cool. Oh my gosh, look at these. Oh, there's a hammock. There's a hammock. <laughs> <laughs> There's a hammock. I didn't know you could even have a hammock. That is so fun. I've been trying really hard not to spoil things for myself by uh, looking at the different public works projects. I just kind of want to be surprised by them. So that's so exciting. And this is interesting. So I guess we could put a custom path if we wanted to throughout our town area. So throughout our entire town plaza. And that might help to make it or at least the area around town hall especially look a little bit more professional. So I might put paths down around town hall and around the new buildings we're building by town hall so where is uh, where is all of this so who's here Bew, huh hmm i think that guy's a bear maybe <gasps> look at the fountain oh it really is so pretty i definitely want to put the fountain look at that it's so lovely. I definitely want to be able to put the fountain uh, in front of our town hall, I think. <gasps> Are you a duck? You're a little duck. This is our first time meeting, isn't it? I hope you have lots of fun visiting Tortal, girl. Oh my gosh, it's a duck. A deer or no, 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 not a deer. You must be visiting Tortal. Well, it's nice to have you. Have a great time here, eh? Oh my gosh. Antelope. Oh my gosh. Ducks. I didn't know these guys even existed. Oh, look at these. Oh, this is cute. Look at these tulips. I'm kind of envious about these tulips. The roost is closed 24 hours. Oh, there's even a fancy bench here. What? Wow. And the hibiscuses. I do have some hibiscuses. I just wasn't sure if hibiscuses would look very good this time of like year. The red ones, maybe they would. I do love hibiscus flowers. I should probably, <gasps> I should put hibiscus flowers up next to town hall with our, our golden peaches. That would be really cool. I love this. This is really cool. I can't wait to get some golden roses. That'll look really good in our greenhouse building. So let's see what kind of places there are to visit here. Is this, this is town hall. Town Hall will be closed today. Thank you for your understanding, Tortal Town Hall. Oh, hello, George. Learn at Tortal School. You guys have a school? Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. That's flowers. Flowers everywhere. Oh, school? Oh my gosh, there's a sign. <gasps> I need to make signs. So this is the schoolhouse? Oh, I'm so excited. I've never seen inside somebody else's house before, other than Chips' house, and that doesn't count, because he's my Chips. Oh, <gasps> you have hamsters? There's hamsters! You guys, there's hamsters! There's hamsters! Oh my gosh, I didn't know that this is what the room will look like when it's this big. Wow! Wow, look at this! They should have a golden apple for the teacher. That would be really cool. The books, oh my gosh. I didn't know you could make a school. This is charming. What's over here to the right? I should have probably gone back first, but I'm just so excited. All over the place. Oh... My gosh, it's an art room! <gasps> Look at everything you can put down! What is this? What is this, you guys? <laughs> I'm so curious! Look at all of this! The Mona Lisa, there's a little spot to leave your shoes. Oh, this is too cool. 
There's music playing. I wonder if you can control what kind of music is playing. KK Blues is currently playing. Oh my goodness, what a cute little art setup. I love the tarp that's on the ground too. That is so fun. So there's an art room to the right. Then let's go ahead and go straight back next and we'll see what's at the back. I love it. Oh, it's the principal's office. I get it. Look at this. This is awesome. I love that wall. <gasps> they That's how you use the little display case? Does Celeste sell that? I'm going to have to like snag this from Celeste because this is, this is so cool. I love these chairs. They'll be perfect for our museum rooms. Oh my gosh. And they've got the fancy flower I've really wanted for a long time and the little ship. This is so cool. Oh, and there's so many bookshelves. <laughs> there's so many items I've never even seen before that we'll have to snag. Oh, I love this little school. Is that a backpack over here? Oh, no, it's the little stereo. Oh, and I think they have like, yeah, look, they have the certificate hanging up to let you know that this is a, an official school. It's not just some spooky place. All right, let's go to the left and we'll see what the school has to the left. It's so charming. <gasps> a science room! Oh! It's got the perfect music playing for a science room too. Oh, I'm so happy. I found where I can come and like learn all of the sciences. You can turn on the, that. Oh my goodness. This is perfect for a science room. This is awesome. A plus, I feel like I shouldn't be in here in my bare feet. Look at all of these models. I didn't know you could get so many autonomy models. Fascinating. Look at that, you can see the blood system, circulatory system, skeletal system, muscular system, and organs. Oh my goodness, a computer bank. There's even things on the wall in the back. You guys, I love this school. All right, so I really, really love the school. I really love the golden roses. It's gonna be very fun. I think that's really a fun challenge actually. Oh, <gasps> there's ups and downs. <gasps> I didn't even see it. I was so excited by everything else. I didn't even notice this is fully, oh, it's a music classroom. Oh, and the music playing in each room is so perfect. Is that bagpipes? Oh my gosh. The music playing in each room is perfect for this. And I could just join in. Oh man. See, I haven't even seen most of these items. It makes me want to redo my entire room. My room is literally just a mess right now, but that's because I'm just sort of like hoarding everything I can get my hands on. I want Sahara to come back so I can get more of... Oh, it's a, a PE room! Oh my gosh, imagine all the jock villagers down here. They would love this room. Okay, I love it. The school is totally awesome. I'm really eager to see what some of the other buildings are now too. It's not quite as autumn themed as I thought, but that's okay because you never really know what you're going to get for some dream addresses till you jump in. And I am pleasantly surprised because I was not expecting to stumble on a really cool school. Excellent, George. I hope you have a wonderful time with your schoolhouse. It was really awesome to see. See you in another dream. Oh, and look. Oh, the ginkgo leaf. That's one of the ones I want. So we have a little heart shape, ginkgo leaf. I like how the waterfall is in the center of town here. That's very pretty. And then this one is the little citrus cut, the butterfly cut. I need to get some of those, um, some more of those special. Oh, this path looks awesome. But I need to get some more of those special pieces cut. Oh, there's bananas. I don't have any bananas yet. I wonder where you get bananas. I'm, I'm going to have to think about that. Very lovely with all the shells lining the seashore. And then we'll work our way over here. And up we go. Oh! <gasps> Are you a woodpecker? Anchovy is such a cute, cute name. Oh my gosh. Oh, Chirp. Oh, I want you in my town. You don't want to know what I've heard about Mayor Ruthie? Apparently, she's a real hometown hero. Who knows if there's any truth to that rumor? I would say there is. I mean, look at your town. You guys have an amazing town. Oh, it's more of the special cuts. Okay, what's this? Anchovy's house. Oh, geez. Everything is so cute. I love all the paths everywhere. Who are you? Are you a bunny? You are bunny. Your name is actually bunny. Hey, someone new. I guess I've never seen you before. Wait, let me guess. You're one of my biggest fans, right? So this must be like a dream come true. Good to meet you. Oh my gosh, bunny. That's so cute. Who Whose house is this? Hmm, is this the mayor's house? I'm, I'm just gonna walk right in, don't mind me. We'll take a really quick tour. So basically I'm learning. Oh wow, very fancy, oh my goodness. Oh hello, I think that's Mayor Ruthie. Hello? 
Welcome to tutorial. Oh my gosh, it is me, Ruthie. I hope you don't mind that I'm just like rummaging around in your whole house. She's got a very refined sense of style. It kind of feels like, um, oh, I love it. Oh my gosh, look at all the food items. You guys, it's like an autumn buffet. I love it. Look at all of that. Can I get these food? Oh my gosh, there's food everywhere. But this is so cute. Look at this autumn harvest of stuff right here. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get some of these because that little basket is just adorable. A little toaster, a nice kitchen set up. That's so cute. I think I can hear the coffee pot like brewing. Oh, that's adorable. I wonder if it's I wonder if it's some of the fancy coffee from Brewster's place. And I love the plants in there. I love seeing how everyone decorates. This is so much more exciting than I thought it was going to be. Oh, Ruthie, may I pardon me? You even got a quill right there. Oh, that's so fancy. I really love just all of the details too. Wow, wow. <laughs> this is a bathroom fit for a queen. Look at this, can I climb in here? I wanna get in that, that's awesome. Oh my gosh, and there's wall plants. <gasps> I'm gonna have to get the wall plants somehow, somewhere. I love the little laundry setup. This is adorable. Lots of attention to detail, very realistic. I think that that's going to be a difference with kind of uh, a lot of my houses is I want to show off so many specimens. It's probably going to be like I just wash under the waterfall in town. <laughs> I don't have a bathroom in my house. And it'll probably be like I don't even have a kitchen. I just eat the fresh fruit out my window. Oh, look at this. This is so cute. Oh, look at her. Wow, she's got a golden trophy. What is that for? You can turn on the little light. That's adorable. And she's got the golden fish trophy, and she's got the golden bug trophy, and then the golden house trophy. Oh, it's a little electronic digital, um, it's one of the digital photo frames. That is so cool. This is awesome. <gasps> you can have birds. You guys. You guys. You guys. I need that. I need that bird. I would have, I would just have a whole room full of those birds. It would just be an aviary. I, I didn't, I didn't, I mean, hamsters, birds, I didn't even know you could have those things. This is very exciting for somebody who's not familiar with all of the items that you can have in New Leaf yet. So this is actually exceptionally thrilling. Oh, what a cute little kid's room. Oh, this is adorable. I love the miniature houses. That's so cute. I really like that. There's so many items I've never even seen before. I can't believe this. And I wonder what the, the update that's coming out, is that on the 2nd of, of October or the 8th? Sometime around then, the update's gonna be coming out and it's gonna be really exciting to see what it turns into. Oh, and a craft room? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So many things. So many things. I have hardly scratched the surface with all of the different things that you can find. Thank you, Ruthie. It was very nice to visit your home. Wow. Okay. That was really fun. So, Mayor of Tortal, named Ruthie. And Tortal as, as a town. Very, very nice. Very nice. Oh, look at this. A whole area. Oh, look at this. This is what I'm talking about. Hanging out with the scarecrow for the arrival of autumn. This is a cute little spot right here. I like it. All right, and I see these golden peaches make pretty good autumn additions because they are so shiny. So maybe we'll just focus on planting tons and tons of golden peaches. Oh my goodness. And so many cute little houses. Oh, there's a park. Oh, there's a park. Oh, and there's mushrooms all over the park. <laughs> mushrooms! Mushrooms! You can have a little picnic area too! What? I can't believe this. I love all of the mushrooms. Oh, they're so cute. And the way that the hedge fencing is made. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, this is so adorable. Look at this little sandbox. Oh my goodness. And then the I saw more mushrooms. So yeah, lots more mushrooms over here. <gasps> a log! I want this log. I wonder how I can get this log in my life. Oh, it's so cute. Yeah, I'm really happy with all of this. Who's, what is this? Is this the police station? Is it closed right now? Oh, I can go into it. I don't have a police station yet. Why, hello, sir. Please enjoy your visit to our town, citizen. 
ah, I'm going to have to get one of the police stations set up in the future because that would be really fun. And you can find all the random items up there now and then too, which might help me find the bird. Now now I'm blocked on. I want a bird. Um, There's the reset center. Look at these flowers. Oh, beautiful hybrids. Beautiful hybrids. There's a cute little bus stop area. This is very nice. So many bushes. Oh, there's a windmill. Oh, rare flowers. There's an arcade. <laughs> what? Oh my gosh, that's hilarious. I think that's named after John Tron. So let's go inside the arcade. Looks really cool on the exterior for an arcade too. And then we'll probably head back. We'll, we'll wind around town and head back after this. This is amazing. I'm just sort of like overwhelmed and blown away because this is the first time I'm seeing almost all of these items. I didn't even know they existed. You know what I mean? So we'll see what the arcade has to offer. I wonder if there's like, oh, cool. This is awesome. What a creative way to like set up a paintball area. This is awesome. That's so creative. I would not have thought to do that. All right, let's come down and see what's down here. Everything. It's just so fun to see how people will take the same items and the same layouts and create something completely <gasps> bowling. See what I mean? And just get in here and create something completely unique. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's go over. I definitely want to get our town. Like this is just getting me so pumped to work harder on our town too. So let's go over and check out the last couple rooms. Then we'll head back down because now I'm pumped. Oh, come on. This is awesome. Setting up for a big giant chest room like this. Putting down go boards. Oh, see, that's so creative. It's just a few items and everybody can use them differently. We're definitely going to have to do more dream, dream town visits. And like I said, if you guys want to leave your dream town address in the comment section, then what I'll do is I'll go and put a little list and then I'll use a random generator. Oh, wow. Chips would like this area. The reason he has his name Chips is because he loves poker. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is fantastic. Yeah, if you guys want to leave your dream town addresses, if you're really like proud of them or want to show them off to everybody, then what I'll do is I'll put them in a big list and I'll use a random generator and I will pick from that list uh, once a month. Hopefully we'll start there. <gasps> so, oh my gosh, Pikmin! <laughs> Pikmin! Okay. Okay, yeah, I need to be getting more items. I, I knew there was more that I hadn't found yet in, in our world, but I had no idea there was that much more. Okay, yeah. So, if you guys want to visit Tortal, you saw the dream address, and I'll try to leave a link not only to the dream address, but also to the Tumblr that, uh, oh, oh, so cute. <laughs> but also to the Tumblr of the, um, the, the Ruthie, Ruthie, Mayor Ruthie, who made this. Oh, what's this? Oh my gosh, you're kidding me. Dine and shop inside. Okay, this will be our last thing we check out and then we'll go home. You can actually have like a whole house that actually looks like a gingerbread house. Oh my goodness. Okay. This makes me really want to make sure that maybe our museum can do like an event room on in the main floor. Is that a chocolate fondue? Chocolate and white chocolate fondue fountains? A cake shop? I want a cake. Okay, we're saying we got a we got a strawberry cake from here because that that's just so cute. But yeah, if you guys want me to visit, then like I said, comment. Let me know what you want to be called. This so cute. Using a little custom design to stand in as one of the employees. Oh my gosh. I could really wander this town for a long time, just savoring all the details and coming up with stories. And it really, really, really makes me want to work on our town. So a little conveni to the right. Let's see what's at the back back here. And then we'll head back home. You guys, this is amazing. I'm seeing so many items. Pies! I'm seeing so many wedding cakes that I've never seen before. That I've never even imagined existed. There's even candy dispensers. This will be really fun to see what we can bring to our world. So if you happen to visit Tortal, what would be like your favorite one of the buildings or your favorite place in town? Because I think I would probably spend... A lot of time right here. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it. All right. All right, we're done. We found we found the ideal plant retreat for Siri. 
Um, I know exactly where I would be. I would be right here shopping for autumn flowers in Tortal. Uh, this is kind of gorgeous and amazing and I love all of the rare flowers that are on display. This is exactly what I want to pull off more or less with the greenhouse that we're going to set up in one of our, in our garden. In our two, we have our two museums and one is going to be focused on being the botanical garden. So that is definitely what I'm going to do. All right, and we'll, that, I, I love that. I would be in that flower shop for sure. And we'll check out the basement, we'll check out the attic, and then congratulations, Mia Ruthie, you've got a beautiful place. You've, she's clearly worked so hard on this. There's so many items and so much detail here. There's cash registers. I'm gonna have to find those cash registers too. Yeah, there's just so many items, so much detail. And clearly a lot of care has gone into setting everything up to create such a wonderful story with just how we arrange, like how she's arranged the items. <gasps> There's another birdcage! Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. There's a rainbow. Oh my gosh. This is stunning. Okay. Yeah, this is amazing. <laughs> I hope you guys have enjoyed. I've enjoyed it. I'm definitely blown away. I can't even, I don't even recognize any of the items in here. And it just gives me so much hope. I have the, I've had the fancy doll and I think that's about it. It gives me so much hope for the sheer excitement of being able to discover more things in Animal Crossing New Leaf and sharing the adventures as Moss Tree Village hopefully one day can grow into a place that's even just a tiny bit as amazing as this town. And I can't wait to go and visit more towns in the future. Hopefully that will start being a relaxing Sunday thing that we can do together. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.